first of our finalists. Throughout the series, John's proved that he's got it all. He can lead, he can follow, he can shake and bake. And what more could we ask for a potential winner? Maybe a bandana and a pirate ship? Well, he's actually done that too. So here's John and Jojo's Strictly Journey. I don't know if there are any transferable skills between baking and dancing. Rhythm, stirring that pot, get the hips going. But I think that's about it. I think it ends there. <laughs> I'm really looking forward to this journey with Johannes. We can reverse roles, and if we get it right, we are setting a template for what this could be. This is a testimony to the same-sex couple. It was stylish, it was clean, it was powerful. Just carry on like that, please. We need to help John come out of his shell. I feel like a big idiot. This can be very exposing. Inside my head, there's that voice saying, oh, don't be too flamboyant. So I need to try and silence that little voice. Style, power, punch, I loved it. I believe there is nothing that you can't do. Outstanding for me today. I'm so proud of you. Sarah. I'm proud of you, baby. I've learned to just say to those voices, off you pop, I'm dancing. The footwork, the power, you did each role exquisitely well. That was brilliant! No. The Paso Doble was a life-changing moment for me. I will cherish that forever. Seven, eight. We haven't yet worked out who's going to lift who. One, two. He's stronger than me, but I know the technique. You're a super, super dancer. Energy, character. It feels like you're the couple to beat. Ten. Light on your feet and some beautiful footwork. I absolutely loved it. I feel like you sit back on routines. I'd love you to just push <laughs> forward with the energy. This experience has been exhausting. You come in really quite tense after the weekend and you think, oh, I've got to learn a new dance. And that's when you kind of put a shield up. We need to boost his confidence. He just wants to do himself proud and me. Your performance is just a bit safe. I just want you to let the handbrake off and let yourself go. The hardest thing about taking to the dance floor is just to quieten those voices. You know, I started off very, very scared. The most nervous contestant, I think. Johannes has been a constant source of support. I've never seen him work so hard. I'm so proud of this man. They're back! It was fantastic seeing the tango done in its original form by two men. Ten! I had never felt that confident. If I put my mind to it, I can do anything. Johannes has taught me about having self-respect. He's believed in me, and I love him so much. Getting to the next level means you have to risk it, and I do feel you risked it. It has really been a special experience dancing with John, and one of which I will forever carry in my heart. The amount of support that people have shown to Johannes and me, it's something that I'll treasure for the rest of my life. For the first time, you were the star. I felt like you were leading it, and you did that immaculately. This experience, it's been about more than just the dancing. It broke down barriers. I knew you had it in you. I thought it was absolutely superb. John and Johannes. I didn't recognise myself in that dance-off. I now know what giving 100% feels like. And that is what I'm going to do for the final. I've learned not only to dance, but to believe in myself. It's been life-changing. I'll look back at this and I'll think, well, that was wonderful, wasn't it? Oh, congratulations! You're in the final, <laughs> babies! Oh. Well, how, how are you feeling after watching that? Very emotional. Yeah. Absolutely devastated that I've got, I've got mince pie crumbs on me, I've spilled my <laughs> tea, I've got beard dandruff everywhere, I look oh. a hot mess, but... It yeah. feels just in, to, to, to watch that back and look at you know, the adventure that we've had together and how far we've come and just 
It's just overwhelming. I, I, I feel very, very emotionally overwhelmed yeah. with it all, which isn't good, because I've got to go out there tomorrow night and do three oh, dances. but I have all the faith in you, baby. You said it. <laughs> now you know 100% what it feels like. Let's talk about your dances that you're going to be doing tomorrow night. You are doing the Paso Doble. It is yeah. definitely an audience favourite. Um, but you said to Rylan that you were going to be an aggressive, dirty pirate. Oh, Phil. So are we going to, like, up the ante on the characterization of the pirate this, this it's weekend? It's going to be the angriest, muckiest pirate you've seen. It'll be full of <laughs> mud and blood and toil and sweat and tears. <laughs> Yeah, we're just going to go for it this week. Because I think the thing is, having been in the dance-off last week, I now know what it means to give everything. Mm. And I know I don't feel afraid. For the first time ever, I don't feel afraid about performing tomorrow. Because whatever happens, we've, we've, we've got here. And I didn't think we would get here. Not because I doubted Johannes, because I doubted me. I thought I'd be like the, the concrete block around his poor legs. Uh, <laughs> but the fact that we're here, there's, nothing to, there's no pressure now. Nothing else matters apart from tomorrow going out and celebrating what we've achieved together and yes. our partnership, and I can't wait for that. No, I can't wait to watch. You're going to be amazing. I know it already. But Jojo, the yes. judges picked the Roomba. Uh -huh. um, there was a couple of things that they thought that you guys could improve on. Uh -huh. How has it been going this week, bringing it back into the training room? It's been going very well, Jeanette. I mean, we took it back to the basics. We stripped it down again. And the most important thing was to just get the emotional connection because the last time I think we had nerves, yeah. but now that we are where we are, I feel like we can give it our all and really come through with what the judges have advised us to do. And it's going to be beautiful. We did it today and it obviously feels different from week seven. Really? Yeah. This is the it exciting is. bit. <laughs> well, what I think what I've learned is that the steps are important, of course they are. But if all you think about is the steps, then you don't have any emotion. You don't, like, you know, Craig said to me, you have this glass barrier. Mm. And I get it now. Don't worry about the steps. They'll fall into place. Just think about the connection. Think about the narrative of the story. Yeah. And, and that's the artistry. That's, that's where the artistry comes out, right? Exactly. Uh, but we need to talk about the show dance. You said when you were talking to Ryan <laughs> that it's like a medley busier than a Destiny's Child remix. Oh. Uh, so how have you been handling the show dance? How's it going? I love the show dance. It's like it's the perfect dance to sum up our friendship, our, our experiences. Mm -hmm. And it? it's just, I mean, it is full. Flicks, kicks, lifts, spins, twirls and leaps and whatnots. Everything, it's like a pick and mix. It's it a really, pick and mix. It's a pick and mix. <laughs> this is, Jason Gilkinson has done us proud. He's completely jam-packed it full of just such wonderful choreography. It's a cracking song. And I just can't wait for the world to see it because it's it's oh. going to be it's like a, a Lady Gaga concert basically oh, tomorrow. Wow, I'm in for that. Thank oh, you yeah. very much. Oh, yeah. And now I know you've had a bit of an emotional week. You've had exhaustion. You're tired, and I don't want to set you off. But we do have an amazing little clip of your friends and family, and they want to celebrate your journey for you. Okay. I like that. John was always a bit of a star, really. We used to joke and call him the golden boy because he could never do anything wrong. John is a born performer and uh, he was made to be on Strictly. I think it's his, his moment. When I saw John dance for the first time, I just thought, this is amazing. It couldn't, it couldn't have gone better. I'm really proud of Uncle John dancing with Johanna. Well, it's amazing, really, because it's the first the boy and boy dancing together. I think the more support he's got, I think that spurred him on each week. Because um, I think he's not just doing it for himself, he wants to inspire people. I think the Paso is probably my favourite because that was just amazing. Ten. When John got his first tens in week three, it kind of dawned on me how monumental that is. If he was to win, oh, it would be life-changing, definitely. To know that he was so nervous at the very beginning, to now being in the final, it's amazing to see it pay off. I love him, I think he's great. I know you can do this. Go out there, be yourself. Everyone is so proud of you, especially me. Good luck. You've made us all so, so proud. And I love you to bits. John, 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 John. John, 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 John. Oh, how lovely is that? I want to squeeze you so bad. I hate that we can't. No, I need to ask you both, OK? I know the competition has meant much more to the two of you than winning, but what would it mean to the two of you to win that glitter ball tomorrow night? Oh, I don't, I don't care about winning. I, know it's, I shouldn't say that. I don't care. I don't care if we lift a glitter ball or not, because I think what we've done is we've done it. We've done it, and I'm so proud of us. I'm so proud of us, and I'm so proud of you. 
Thank you. And my fa I'm still... So uh, overwhelmed yeah. with that. It's, yeah. it's so, how amazing to know all the support, not just from your family and friends, but the two of you have gotten so much. Georgia, what would it mean to you to hopefully hit that door wall? It would restore my faith in humanity. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going deep there because that's what it would mean. It's huge, it's big, but for the fact that we're here, says a lot already so i'm i'm so grateful that we did honestly yeah and i think we are so grateful that you are here they've been amazing everybody yeah. have they not <laughs> Give a round of applause. but listen best of luck get some rest because we've got a yeah. big night yeah. tomorrow boys give it up for jojo and john everybody Thank you. Thank you both.